All right, boys and girls, how you doing? Russell True Results 303.com. Check out the website. Subscribe to the newsletter. Get instant updates whenever new materials coming out, so you know what's happening, and you can switch things up, add a little fun and excitement to your routine. All right. So today, oh, don't forget to check the description box. Link to the website right there. Um, also links to Twitter, Facebook, things like that so you can connect with me. Coming at you today, video, Swiss ball, leg curl. We all do the leg curl machine. You know, it's a good exercise to target the hamstring back of the leg. Uh, but sometimes it's good to add in a little bit of stability work on the same thing. We're going to be activating way more muscles, firing more muscles, firing up more muscles, more activation, adding balance in there as well. So it's just just all around fun and excitement going on in this exercise. So, when I, whenever I see this move done, I see a lot of people performing it wrong. First off, I see a lot of people were here and they're just going like this. This is not the movement. I don't know what this is. I mean, uh, I mean, this is, this is kind of relaxing if you ask me. I mean, this is enjoyable. Always having your legs up, that's enjoyable, but this is not the movement, all right? This isn't it. Even if we're coming in, even if we're picking that butt up off the ground and going like this, this is not correct, all right? We're not engaging any of the glutes here in this movement. The glutes are just not firing at all. We're getting some hamstring, yes, but the glutes, no, active, no activation, all right? So we're only getting half that movement. So we've got to make sure, same thing if we're doing a normal bridge, right? We're here. If we're bridging, see that body nice and perfectly straight from the shoulders up to the knee, perfectly straight. That's how the ending position should be for this Swiss ball, leg curl. So we're here coming up all the way, engaging. Now the glutes are engaged, hamstrings are engaged, everything's burning, even some cramping I felt a little bit there. Party's going, all right? So same up, nice and big, back down. Remember we, want to, remember, we want to make sure that that weight's in the shoulders. We don't have the weight on the back of the head. I could have the head up and just resting it down. None of that weight is on the head. We're not going to put any of that force on the neck itself. So all the weight's in the shoulders coming up. Hold it, back down, slow and control. Up, back down, slow and control. We want to get dangerous. We really want to amp it up. We're going to switch it. We're going to go single leg. All right, so one leg on. We'll still have this leg straight out. We don't want to have it resting. We still want it straight up. Remember, weight in the shoulders, not in the neck, not on the head. So we're here coming straight up, curl, back down, up, back down. Switch it up, same thing. Weight in the shoulders, weight in the heel, heads at rest. We're here coming up, back down, up, back down. Woo! Hamstrings are on fire. Got them cramping up there. All right, folks, so there you go. Swiss ball leg curl. Add this to your exercises. This is when, you know, if we're not going for that really heavy set on the leg curl, this is where we're going to come in, sports and conditioning. This is going to help you on the athletic field. We're engaging many more muscles of the hip, of the hamstring, of the glute, all them little stabilizers. A lot of activity going on in this area. Really, really good exercise, all right? So add this to your routine if you're an athletic person. Now, if you're someone who's bodybuilding, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't suggest this. That's not part of your routine. You're not training for things like that. But if we are definitely looking for improvements and gains on the athletic field, whatever your sport is, I think this is a really good exercise that we should add in. So don't forget to share the video, like the video, let people know that it's out there, let them know the website it's out there. You know, let's all help each other out, get faster, fitter, stronger in the gym. Have a good one.